good afternoon. We are at Hippo Creek with Jim Fonsale, am I correct? That's right, correct. He, you're the owner for Hippo Creek? Correct. Please tell us a little bit about the range. How long has it been in existence? What's your plans, etc., etc.? Yes, Hippo Creek started off as, a, as an idea and we were looking for premises. And me and my son went pigeon shooting on the farm a couple, about 12 years ago, 13 years ago. And he said to me, well, why don't you do the range here? And I said to him, well, that's a good idea. And the next weekend we had our first shoot. Uh, this was 2007 and 2008 we started building and uh, our first competition was here on the 11th of February 2008. So uh, it's been a long time in the coming and uh, we then had great aspirations and uh, we tended for the uh, FITAS Compact sport, uh, Sporting uh, World Championships in 2014, which we were very lucky to get. And uh, coincidentally, my son in law, Tim Abner, won it. Fantastic, he's a, a clay pigeon shooter. Clay pigeon shooter, yeah. So, uh, all in all, Hippo has been good to us and has been a significant facility. We started off very small with one range and We've now grown to, the, uh, to where we have uh, four rifle ranges, uh, 200 meters, one 200 and one 300. We've got 16 uh, shotgun ranges, uh, varying in all the various disciplines for, uh, of shotgun shooting. And uh, we also have what we call the gong range, which is about 1.3 kilometers long. Uh, ranging from 400 every 100 meters up to 1.3 kilometers. Yeah, and uh, we've just now opened, in the beginning of the year, we've just opened our indoor 50 meter rimfire range, uh, which has been uh, a very, very successful uh, venture. Uh, we have had two very big competitions already there. So yes, we've, we're getting there. We've hosted many national competitions. Where do Hippo go from here? Uh, we are currently busy uh, putting up some, some gongs and we're putting up some steel, uh, steel uh, shooting facilities. Uh, and hopefully in the beginning of next year, we'll be able to host a lot of those. Uh, as you very well know, as uh, the guys from uh, South African uh, PRF have joined us uh, late last year and they've had quite a couple of very big competitions. Um, so yes, we, 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 we are doing our thing and I'm very, very fortunate to be able to say that for the first time ever, next Saturday on the 18th of September, we're also hosting the South African Hunters Association National Shotgun Shooting Competition oh, here. That's absolutely fantastic. So uh, we're very excited about the developments. Okay, COVID had its setbacks absolutely. as for all of us, but uh, yes, we are getting there and we're really looking forward to the future. So Jim, if anybody wants to contact you, is it on the, do you have a website? Yes, we do have a website, all our facilities and all our uh, our contact details is on our website. We are we also correct yes okay. correct <laughs> <Right>. yes. <laughs> and uh, uh, if they need to find us, we are also on Google Maps. So we just put in there Hippo Creek Shooting Center, and uh, you're bound to find us. So the closest to, uh, to you is Funabar Park, am I correct? Correct yes correct. It's about 80 kilometers from Johannesburg. Roughly, yes, it's about a three, uh, three quarters of an hour drive from uh, Oliver Tambo. Okay. Um, and uh, so we have quite a few guys that visit us uh, in the um, shotgun shooting season uh, to come and practice here, uh, especially from, from uh, Great Britain uh, and the European Union uh, countries. So yes, we, we, we're known all over the world especially since the World Championships in 2014. Great, thank you very much. Thanks for your time. Thank you very much. Thank you, Jim. Thank Thanks you. a lot.